Hey guys, today we'll be unboxing the Surface Pro 3 Cyclops Series Trident Case. This is the black edition and it is completely compatible with the kickstand and the type cover keyboard. It has protection on the back of the computer and the front screen. And the case allows for the touch screen to work. And it is also uh, tested to meet their military standards for drop protection. So let's get right into it. First, to open the case, we need to come to the top corner and grab out this tab, which is somewhere in there. I've already. Great job. There we go and pull out the case inside. Here we have the case in a plastic sheet and if we just pull it out and we have the case in black. Now, if we can take to do the un to do the unboxing and taking apart, you just need to unclick all the corners and edges so that we can get the case out, which I am must do very well at because I am a genius. If we eventually get this out, these two I'm having trouble with. There we go. One out and the last one out. And now it is turned into three pieces. Type cover cover. That makes no sense. Type cover cover. Window frame thing. Ha. Window frame. Unintentional pump. And then the back cover with the kickstand part. So to attach it to the Surface Pro 3, simply detach the keyboard. And then turn the surface into a tablet by flicking up the back panel thing. Now, get out the front cover part and front face down the surface into it. Make sure it fits tightly pretty simply. Now get the back plate and firstly stick it into the corners. I've got that on the wrong way because I am a very smart person. And click it in to all the points that are before, so not this bit, these points, but the ones here. And click them in. Make sure they're in properly and that you've got no trouble. Make sure that everything is clicked in properly. Properly. I can English very well. Click, click, click. And, of course, the last one somewhere here. Alright, now, we've done that. We need to install, or we now we need to put in the deck plate. So, simply 
lift it up. I hope I've done this right because I feel like it's trapped in the surface case. There we go. Now flick up this part and flick him in properly. This is not working because I don't know if it gives We will be back when we solve the problem. Finally! Right, okay. Then, once you've done, did that, just, okay, click it in, in all the spots, making sure that it is completely in, safely and properly. Apparently I fully shut down my surface then. Making sure every little bit is tightly put in, unlike these corners and that bit yep okay it looks like it has been done does the back even work though I hope it does because if it doesn't I want my money back yes it works and close. Now, here is the type cover plate thing which I am going to stick into here. This shouldn't be that hard. This is honestly pathetic. And there we go, finally, after about 20 minutes of work, it is done. The case is on. And and I look to be, I mean, you can't know how I look, but I think it was worth 20 minutes of putting on cases stuff, because this is pretty sturdy. Now, let's see if the kickstand actually works, because it should, and I'm not entirely sure about that. Kickstand would work by taking down the bit. Does this wait? Hang on a minute. Take the kickstand down, I believe. We may have to take this off. To take it off, just, just kind of slide it and then, yep, yeah, done that. Okay, take the kickstand out. Now, touching the keyboard is simple. It's pretty normal. Just go here, click under there, and that is it. And your keyboard works perfectly fine. And doing this also works perfectly fine as well. And pop that down. And that is it. Really simple. So, If you're looking for a surface case that is really durable and fairly, uh, sorry, it's not really that cheap, but you can get it for around a hundred dollars, and it is pretty good deal, and it's definitely worth it. And that's really it for the video. Thanks for watching and goodbye.